so 40 bars dropped a crazy video on QB Black Diamond last night or yesterday as Chrome 23 is going to be just in a little while. And uh, 40 bars exposes QB Black Diamond allegedly for at 19 years old falsely accusing someone of sexually assaulting her. And you know how we do. You know, we say, should she be in better rap? Big K exposed Adi Boom. Should she be in better rap? That's crazy. That's whack. Should she be in better rap? Where's QB? She got to speak up. Will this be in the round? What's she, what's she going to do? Is she going to rebel it? Will she rewrite it? Here's the thing. To which I feel like us, we don't do this enough. And I'm going to say this in the first two minutes so I know I won't be monetized. Fuck battle rap. <laughs> I don't care about battle rap. I'm here to have a conversation y'all ain't going to have. I think any woman that falsely accuses a man of sexually assaulting her should be in jail. I'm not talking specifically about QB. I'm saying in general. And I think it's whack that a man who just rapped yesterday can still be made fun of for being molested by an older woman. That's whack to me. See, this is a conversation I want to have. Fuck battle rap. We need to have this conversation of why certain men don't do certain things, don't show emotion, can't be into, can't because we get falsely accused and then you make fun of when we deal with certain trauma and you wonder why men are the way they are. I'm talking about the men that are falsely accused. And are actually assaulted themselves. We don't want to have that conversation, do we? No, we don't. This is about better rap. Keep it better rap. But then you want to delve into someone's personal life and dig up their real name. <laughs> and dig up real childhood things about them. Whether they expose it themselves or you investigate it or people are calling you or DMing you about it. I said this yesterday. I never dropped the video. It was a short video about I don't know how much longer I have watching Battle Rap. I said it, kind of said it yesterday in my recap. I don't know how much longer I have to watch Battle Rap because it gets to a point to where it becomes too toxic. You have to be mentally messed up to continue to watch this because we watch as much as it's great to have the bars and the metaphors and the similes and the, all that. We have to watch somebody be broken down as a woman and as a man continuously all day and all night. Same thing for bloggers. Bloggers fight. They break down their entire life. <laughs> Who their mama was? Who they sleeping with? What happened with this? It's like, I don't have enough space anymore to want to continue to watch that. But that's not about that. It's about, if you want to have the conversation, I know a lot of people are going to talk about, oh, that's crazy. Is she going to rebel in the battle rap? Fuck battle rap. Fuck that. Fuck that. I don't care about battle rap. We need to talk about the actual conversation about men being falsely accused and nothing happened to the women and men being molested and nobody saying anything except judging the person that was molested. When you're ready to have that conversation, you let me know.